Hey everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing some Cinderella inspired nails. Specifically, these nails will be inspired by her dress, which is always blue in every single version of Cinderella that I've ever seen. So first I'm starting off with this baby blue acrylic and all the product info will be down in the info box below, just in case you wanna know where I got any of this stuff from. And once I'm done shaping this nail the way I want it to be, I'm going to be putting a glitter mix on top of it. Right now I'm putting a glitter mix on top of that baby blue. It's called Mermaid's Tail. It's a really pretty iridescent blue glitter mix that goes perfectly for this look. And once I'm done putting that on, I will encapsulate with clear acrylic just to keep me from filing that glitter off. On my middle finger, I'll be using a dark blue acrylic that I mixed myself. It actually has some light blue sparkles in there, but the camera didn't pick it up. Um, after I'm done shaping that, I'm going to be putting that same mermaid's tail mix right on top of that as well and then encapsulating. On my ring finger, I'll just be using the mermaid's tail mix um, all by itself, and then I'm going to encapsulate. So my nails have been filed and buffed and now it's time for 3D nail art. So I have a bow, a wedding ring topper, a key, a crown, and a blue rhinestone cluster and some random Swarovski rhinestones I'll be putting on. Now I'll be putting all the large nail art on with acrylic. 
I know some people like to use gel, but I prefer acrylic because I feel like it lasts longer. Now that I'm done with the 3D nail art and the rhinestones, I'm going to put some protein bond around my cuticles and then I will be putting on my UV top coat. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more and thumbs up if you like the video. I'll see you next time. Bye.